That's no way to treat a guest. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you for standing up for me there. Hmm? Hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance Ma to- Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. And when the power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we've found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion, and mine overrules hers. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the scourge dealt us a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the Golden Worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here. Eos. Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. 
The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay. But you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... The way I see it, you need me. If I pull this off, maybe you'll look like the leader you pretend to be. But first, you have to succeed at being the Pathfinder you pretend to be. Where's my ship? They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, KC me and Sam Nude on the Hyperion. Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. You know what they say. It's not paranoia. If someone is out to get to you, yeah. Third time this week. It's getting worse. First one was small stuff. This one could have hurt bad if I'd been closer. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Whoever's doing this has to be stopped before someone gets seriously hurt. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm an engineer, not a PI. I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can think of. But I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait. That's it. You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me. If they start hitting critical systems. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one. That'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omnitool. Just send me the data when you're done. Find out why. Be careful. Pathfinder, to cover their tracks, the saboteur is overloading power to this panel from another junction relay. You can scan and trace the connective wiring to locate the surrogate panel. Lost the hand of Two small pieces. You'd be surprised. There's also Burbine in the seed bank. Nobody's making creeper in Andromeda. You'd be surprised. Security is 
Scan and trace the wiring to locate the panel that the saboteur used. Scanning power junction relays. This panel is malfunctioning. Without more data, I cannot determine if this is a normal malfunction or sabotage. I'll just disable power to the panel until Raj can check it out. Sam. It really is sabotage. Any idea as to who it might be? Yeah. All these panels were worked on by Zara. I just can't believe it. Security video logs confirm that Zara Kellis worked on these panels, as well as the one Raj Patil encountered. Well, shit. Any idea where she is now? Kellis is currently working on a panel on the Hyperion main deck. Zara Kellis? Yes? I have evidence you've been sabotaging the Nexus. What? No, I'd never... I've been looking into this myself. I have the scans to prove it. Here. I'll transfer the scans I took to your Omnitool. Funny. Raj was investigating the same thing. And it led us to you. My scans point at Raj as the one. So unless someone was setting us both up, I just don't understand. The data Miss Kellis has accumulated is strangely similar to Mr. Patel's. A third party seems likely. The real saboteur could be setting you both up. Because we both figured out something was going on? That would make sense. It's better than thinking Raj could have done this. 
but it means all the data I have is useless. Wish I had access to the security cams. I bet we could find something there. You stay put, so whoever did this doesn't realize we're onto them. I'll check out the security cams. Raj, you there? Yes. How did it go? Is it... Is it really her? Wasn't her. She had proof pointing at you. I figure someone's... This file is useless. Let's check another. And another scrambled file. Coincidence seems unlikely. Let's check another. This file is also corrupted. Definitely not a coincidence. You'd need pretty high clearance to mess with the security camera files. Someone working for Candros, maybe. That is the most probable scenario. Think you can get enough out of the files to find a match using biometric scans, Sam? The files were badly scrambled, but if I combine all the available identifiers, it might work. Based on the limited information available, we are looking for a human male, assigned either to the Nexus or Hyperion. You will need to conduct scans from close proximity. Got it. Biometrics do not match. What am I going to do? Negative match. Scan results show a partial positive. Target is most likely suspect. Who is he? Dale Atkins. Reports to Candros' department. Assigned to station security. Dale Atkins, right? We need to talk. Look, not to be rude, but I have work to do. Is that what sabotage is called these days? Work? You're pretty arrogant for the new kid. You don't even know what's been going on. Proof says you've been up to no good. Figures. Screw this. Screw all you hypocrites on this station. You weren't here when they kicked out our loved ones. Mutiny? We just wanted answers. My sister is out there. I don't even know if she's alive or... Whatever happened back then, hurting people now makes no sense. What do you know? I don't care what you think. The mutiny leaders were right to demand to know what was going on. You could have hurt people, killed them. Like those who got killed when the leadership had the Krogan stomp on my friends? I'm done talking. I confess, it was me. 
Do whatever you want. Not my call. The Nexus leaders will make that decision. That lot make a decision? That'll be the day. <laughs> 